Good morning, good afternoon, and good night wherever you are in the world. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And for today's video, I'll be doing a Canada haul. And I will be um, sectioning, dividing the video or the haul into three parts. Clothing haul, stationery haul, and all the other stuff haul. If that makes sense. But for today's video, I'll be doing the part one, which is the stationery haul that I got from Canada. So if you want to know what I got from Canada, just keep on watching. So, sobra, sobrang dami nila na stationary dun. Like, as in sobra. And, sobrang excited ko pumunta sa Canada kasi I wanted to go to Walmart and Target. Kasi I love watching videos wherein um, they go to back to school shopping or just stationary stuff. Ang gaganda lang dun sa US or Canada. So, I got some stuff. Let's just get started. The first thing I got is this letter board. Um, ito yung black. Tapos, galagay ka ng letters to make a word. And here in the Philippines, sa kita ko ng kahapon, sa department store, this is 500 pesos. But I only got this for $4. If you didn't know, um, ang conversion ay 39 pesos isang dollars sa Canada. Let's just say it's 40. It's like 160 pesos. Tapos dito 500. So, sobrang sulit. I got this is dollar store. The next thing I got is this um, metal frame drag erase board. It has gold um, borders and marble yung parang whiteboard niya. And it just comes with two magnets and a marker. And um, I got this at Target for 7 No. I got this at Target sa Seattle for $10. I know, pricey siya, pero aanagaan ko siya, ragamitin ko siya. This is about 500 pesos. Ito lang. Kind of regret it, kind of not. By the way, if you can tell, I'm not in my usual background is because um, this is my sister's bedroom and that's my bedroom which I filmed there. And um, na I thought I was going to film dito because I wanted natural lighting. So um, the last two things from the dollar store are first is this um, postcard that has a Canadian flag. Um, I'll be doing a parang bullet journal na notebook or like travel notebook kung anong pinagpuntahan namin sa kan kung anong pinagpuntahan namin sa Canada and like what are the adventures and I'm gonna be putting on pictures and this thing so yeah this is just 58 cents and then um, my tita um, gave me this um, gold na locker cup this is for the locker, but I won't. I won't be using this for my locker, cause you know, I'm going for the gold team, you know. So I got this thing. This is just a dollar, so this is just forty pesos. So sa dice, so I got four things. The first one is this um organizer na pen, Muji Hu. It's a um duplicate for the Muji. You can't see it, but it has six um six. Where you can put your ball pens and stuff. So it's acrylic and it's just for two dollars. Yeah, this is just eighty pesos, which is like a good deal because it's so much ang mahal. And then I got um, index card holders. I've been finding for these kinds because you mainly the Philippines, as far as I can find, um, is the one with the accordion thing, and I wanted the one with doubt. So here. It looks like that. It's nice because you can just pull them out and give it to me. Because I'm not used to this accordion. I don't know why, but I'm used to it. So this has um, just pineapples on it, and it's color white, and it's very cute. It comes with two for two dollars. Then I got this um, this thing. It's like a pocket pen. 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 And then from Muji, I got two things which surprisingly on the end for me because you know I love Muji. So I got um, scissors which I didn't really need. It was a want. 
It's these um, acrylic. I can't say it's acrylic. Clear scissors. This was a very expensive. This was three dollars, which is like for it was one hundred twenty pesos. It's just um, clear. It's not focusing. It's a clear shot, and it's just scissors. What can I tell about it? It's just so perfect. It's so cute. And then lastly from Muji, I got the pack of pens. The Muji gel ink pen in 0.5 millimeters. Oh, I forgot. From Daiso, I got a brush pen like this. Because I'm having brush pen, don't I just chose this one. And this was $2 as well. Okay, and then I got a pencil case. It's just this yellow and gray one. At first, I thought it was not going to be But when I bought it, it was going to be So... Yo, this is from the brand Lang Yu. Lang Yu? I don't know. It's just that one. Yeah, and it's just this one and that one. So it's very spacious. Pero um, hindi ko talaga ako ng gagamitin ng pencil case. Kasi bala ko magdala ng apat na pencil case sa school, which is like a lot. <gasps> Na I forgot again. From Muji, I got this um clear folder pockets refill for the A5 binder and wala dito sa Pilipinas na ito eh. so I just got this and I have a A5 binder I'm not sure where I'm gonna use it but I have it since I'm a very unforgetful unforgetful my English isn't working since I am so forgetful um I got post-it notes or sticky tabs from Daiso and it's just this uh, princess ones and I really got this because of Rapunzel fail but this is from winners I don't know how to explain it but um, they sell a lot of stuff different stuff for a cheaper price and if you know TJ Maxx winners home sense Marshalls then that's winners so this is a notepad. It says make today beautiful. It's just cute. I didn't really need it, but I got it. It's just lined paper. And then from a random stall in the mall. That rhymes. I got the Zebra Mind Liners. I've been wanting one of these for such a long time. I know my to a national, but I wanted to get the pack, you know, just this. I got this for ten dollars, which is like three hundred ninety pesos, which isn't bad, cause you got five. And then from Michaels, I got this pink glue gun, and um, cause the glue gun ko siya siya na, cause ginamit namin sa mga projects or place namin sa school to make props, so got a new one. It's pink. Um, I got this patches and it's 14 because if you didn't know this is my number it's a volleyball and I'm not gonna change my number anymore so I'm gonna put this in bag ko, which is like the varsity bag so 14 and then I got something from Michael's as well but it's in the buying box because it's too small I got the paint um, na ganon. apple barrel I think I got like 20 paints, I'm not sure, but uh, about that many. And I also got a Mod Podge and a washi tape organizer. And then from Staples, I got this Ticonderoga, Ticonderoga, the world's best pencils. And I got 30 of those in number two. I've seen a lot of YouTube videos that tells me that, that this is really the best pencil so I got them and I wanted to try them and I also got this Crayola signature brush in detail dual tip markers and this is for 16 17 dollars and it has 16 markers moving on to Target which I only got to go to one kasi nga sa Seattle lang I got these things. So first, I got this post-it notes na pastel colors. And then next, I have this Friction Pilot um, highlighters in pastel. And I like this kasi hindi siya bleed through. Unlike the Pentel ones. Pentel? Stabilo ones. Unlike the Stabilo ones. Which I really like that too. Pero I prefer this kasi mas light siya. So hindi siya bleed through. If that makes sense. But depends on you pa rin. 
And then I watch um study tea. Um, she recommended this um Energel na Pentel pens, and I got it. Um, ito talaga yung gusto ko, which is the black ones, and then it has the multicolored ones. So I got both of them. Now on to Walmart. I got a lot of stuff as well. First, I got this Zebra Mind Liner na gray. And then I also got this Mind Li Zebra Mind Liner na different color. Kasi yung kinuha ko kanina is pastel and now yung isang color. Which I'm missing one more pack, which I didn't buy it anymore. And then I got this Twistables no Cariola colored pencils in a pack of 24. And then I got um, Paper Mate pens, which this is a lot. It comes with 24 and just looks like this. Um, meron ito sa SNR pero a thousand plus. Mas mura dun, so I got this. And then, since I'm going to say you know, Energel na ball pen, nabili ko muna to bago yon. So I got the mechanical pencils na Energel na pentel. There's blue and black. And then I also got lead for that. So that I won't run out. So that I don't need to go to Amazon and get some. So I got this. And then I got um, Friction Pilot. Erasable fine liner. I got this and just four pack pink, blue, purple, and black. And lastly, joke, lastly for the ball pens, I got this Z grip na zebra na retractable ball point pen. That's multi colored once again. And then I got this modern millinery signature paper and I use this for my projects as well not this exact brand but I use these kind of papers in mga design so I'm looking forward for more projects this school year which I am afraid of and then lastly from Walmart I got this five star folder in teal and five star is a very good brand because it has five stars Anyway, I got this just a folder. Um, yeah. Last store that I'm, I'll be showing to you guys is Artbox, which became my favorite store ever. Because how cute no stationery, it's like Korean based or puro Korean stuff. There's like Blackpink, Twice, XO, and then just cute stuff. The first thing I got is this um tape mat tape. And I don't know why I got this. It's just so cute. I can't resist. It's just this parang bird. Or it's just a bird. It's a duck. Na yellow. And got that. Along with that, I got this sticky notes or memo pad. That's the same. And it's just very cute. And then to go along with that, I got this um, peach na sticky notes. This is two dollars. This is a dollar and fifty, and the other memo pad is two dollars as well. So cute lang talaga nilo. And then the other sticky note I got is two dollars, and it will just help me with geometry stuff. And it looks like this. It's not focusing. There, it looks like that. It just has lines, and it can help me draw angles. And then I got a ruler that's pink because I lost my ruler now. So along with the tape and the memo pad, I got a binder which I won't be needing for school but I will be using it still. And it's just this binder. By the way, the ruler was $2 which is like 80 pesos which is like, ganda ng quality 80 pesos. So. And this was $5 and I don't want to do math right now. And it just opens up like this and me. Hindi siya yung diganon. Um, it just has this thing, which I know you can open that, and well, ang cute lang talaga. And then going on with the folders, along with the memo pad again, I got this peach na folder, and it's just very cute in design, and it has this flap thing and velcro shaft like that, and tada! So very kakaiba siya. And then I love the next purchase. Oh. Before I go into that, this was three dollars, and the next purchase is this one. I mean, like this was three point ninety five, which isn't a bad deal. It's black pink, guys. So 
So it looks like this. It's very good quality and it opens up like that. So back pink. So as you can tell, it's only me pink. <laughs> um, the first one I got is this notebook and it just has a lot of like vintage. I don't know how to how to describe this, but pinya lang ang kit lang niya and it's lined paper and this was only two dollars eighty pesos, which isn't bad at all. And then I got this macaroon, macaroon na notebook and it's color pink, it's pastel, which I love. Focus, come on. Yeah, this is the prints. It's for two dollars and fifty cents. And lined paper again. And then I got this peach again to go along with the folder. So this notebook is one dollar and fifty cents, which is like around fifty pesos or less this is just lined paper again it's just smooth unlike this one is too rough so the last notebook is this it's a study planner which i'm really motivated to study now but when it comes i don't think i'm gonna be motivated enough to study so yeah and it's just teal this was for five dollars which is not too bad it looks like this it's just matte and when you open it, it's like this. So, yan po details lang. Ito subject, plan list, timetable, to-do list, the month, date, the goal, memo, and homework. You can't see it right now, pero ganyan siya. Madami siyang lines. Hindi siya line, hindi siya dotted, hindi siya grid, hindi siya... Hindi siya yung plain na notebook. So, the whole notebook is like that. Kasi nga, it's a study planner, so... I hope I get motivated when I study. As you can tell, I really love stationery and I don't regret buying these. I love all of them. So yeah, I might post this before I post the vlog. I might do like haul, vlog, haul, vlog, haul, vlog. Because I have, I think, three vlogs in Canada and three na haul. So I'll be posting this first and then vlog and then haul and then vlog. And hold on the vlog. So, yon, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Bye bye. Watch my next video or haul or vlog.